Welcome to another Mr. Mutech video. Today I'm going to show you how to add the Wi-Fi icon or widget on your control center on its own. So you likely have had something like this and you wanted to go ahead and delete one of the functioning connectivity icons here and you have to delete the whole batch on iOS 18. It's very annoying, but fortunately there is a workaround where we can add the Wi-Fi icon because it is not available in the control center when you go look for it. So we have to use shortcuts and I'm going to show you how to do that today so you can get something looking similar to this on your control center, which is how the old iOS appeared. Okay, so what we can do is go ahead and open shortcuts on our iPhone device. So the first thing you want to do is just go ahead and go to your app library by swiping to the left and you're going to go ahead and type in shortcuts. Once you see shortcuts pop up, go ahead and select it. And once it opens up, you want to make sure that you are on all shortcuts. So if you get to this screen, just go ahead and tap on all shortcuts up here. And once you're on all shortcuts, you want to tap this plus sign in the top right corner. Go ahead and tap on that. And then you want to search an action. So go ahead and start typing in Wi-Fi. So once you type in WI, you'll see the top option here is set Wi-Fi. We're going to go ahead and select that. Now, right now it's set to turn Wi-Fi on and we want to change that functionality. We're simply going to press on the turn section here where you see it says turn and there will be a drop down menu and we want to set that to toggle. Once we set that to toggle, we're absolutely done with the functionality of it but you might want the design to look a little bit more like the Wi-Fi symbol. So go ahead and press on this little down arrow here in the top. And what you're going to go ahead and do is change the name to something that you want, such as Wi-Fi. So we can go ahead and just name it Wi-Fi on its own. And then once we do that, go ahead and press done. And then we'll go ahead and press that down arrow one more time. And now we're going to go ahead and choose an icon for it. So tap on choose an icon. Now you may want to also select a color for it. Uh, I like the color blue. So we'll go ahead and select blue here. And you can select any blue that's available or purple. And then what we want to do is look for a symbol. So I'm going to go ahead and scroll down because there is a section where you can find a Wi-Fi symbol. And it's way down here. I'm hopefully going to find it here pretty soon so I can show you and you can go ahead and select it in the same manner. So under communication, okay, uh, there isn't one there. There it is, connectivity. So you could search for connectivity in that little search bar and you're going to select that little symbol there if you want something similar to the old one, okay, or the existing one. And once you tap on that and it's highlighted, go ahead and tap on done. And now you're going to see that you have more an icon more like the Wi-Fi icon that you're used to. Okay. And then in the top right corner, tap on done one more time. And now what we can do is we can add that shortcut to our control center. So pull down on the top right to get to your control center again. Then long press on any available area where there is not an icon and go ahead and add a control. And then what we're going to go ahead and do is scroll down until we see shortcuts, okay? And once we see shortcuts, we're going to select shortcut here. And once we tap on that, it's going to ask us to choose. And now I, I accidentally chose something quickly, so I'm going to go ahead and change that. So tap on choose, okay? And now you're going to want to choose that Wi-Fi that you created. So we named it Wi-Fi, so we selected here. And now we can just tap anywhere on the screen and it's going to create that shortcut. Now what we can do is just drag from the corner to make it fit in with the rest of the icons. And now you have a Wi-Fi that will toggle on and off. So you can go ahead and tap on it and it'll turn your 5G on or whatever your network is on. And then if you tap on it again, it'll go ahead and add the Wi-Fi to it. And you'll see that right up here. And then when you're not on your control center, you'll see that right up here in the corner of your iPhone. So hopefully that's helpful for you guys. I know it is really annoying and tough to not have this Wi-Fi icon here and it is you know, a little bit frustrating and hopefully Apple does understand that people want this 
and they do provide that update in the future. But regardless, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully this was helpful for you guys. If so, feel free to give me a thumbs up. Take care.